Okay, next on solving the 7 by 7 is edge pairing. Okay? Edge pairing is where you edge up all the, I mean, you pair up all the edges to make one big edge and then you can solve it like a 3 by 3. Okay, I can see that I already have a red and, a red and green one that has two and a blue and orange one that has two. I'm going to stick with the blue and orange one right now. What I'm going to need to do it's gonna find another one we're gonna flip it over like that flip it over and find something to take its place you can see that now that one has three but that little greens in the way so if we can find the middle the middle is right there see this is what we're going to do we're gonna flip it flip that one bring it up bring this over and bring it down then put it back and no no centers are messed up and so far look at that one you only need one more this that's my favorite part of the edge pairing because it's just the way that you need to do uh, the way that it looks after you get done with it okay see how that one's done right there that piece needs to go right there you flip that first top layer up flip that up put a piece that will take its place oh I'll take this one over and there you go, we have just finished one edge. That one. Okay, don't mess with it right now. Whatever you do will not mess it up. So just keep it right there. But you, it will move in time. So the next one that we were, we're going to do is... Which one do I want to do? Okay, the green and red one. No, wait, the, the blue and red one. See? They already have some, most of them. Okay, we will have to find a piece. Which, if you know how to solve 5x5, five five, once again, you should already know how to do this. Just find pairs, I mean, little mini edge pieces, and put them in the place. I will be making a 5x5 five five tutorial, which will show you all the ways to do it. Put a piece that will take that place. But it's just, also, we'll put another 5x5 five five tutorial. I mean, I didn't make it, I'm just going to put a link to the side so you'll learn how to do the edges. Then you can come watch my 7x7 seven seven tutorial, which will be a lot easier. Okay, where's the piece I was doing? Okay. Put that right there. See this little mini piece? It needs to go right there. Put that there. We will we'll then bring this up. Bring this over. Bring this down. And then we will put the piece back. Okay, which one are we going to do now? Now that we have another, we have two edges complete. I will do the red and black one. Right there. That's our orange and black, so just don't look at that one. These two. Okay, we will bring this up. Bring this down. Push up. And up. And there you go. There's the little 3x3 three three thing. Okay. So. Gotta find another one. Right here. Gotta put that piece right there. Like always, bring this up. Bring that over. Bring it down. And bring this over. Okay. This is almost finished. Just need one more. Where's that other piece? It's right there. Okay that put that piece right there okay you see that we're almost run out of pieces up here but almost I'll show you when we get to that part what we'll need to do bring that up and turn the up we now have three edges done see got those three edges gotta fill up that edge so let me choose what other edge I'm gonna make I'm gonna make the green and yellow edge so I'm going to flip it like that, and we find what would be easier, okay, okay, flip that up, flip that over, flip that, flip it, and flip it one more time, we now have that right there, we're going to flip that back down. Flip it over, see that's the middle, so we'll just bring these two, we'll get that, 
bring that up, bring that down, and we'll put the middle back. Okay. Still no centers are messed up. Where's the one we're making? Right there. Gotta find the last one. The last one will be right there, so let me flip that up. Oh, it almost went off screen. Okay. We will then flip this. Put up, bring this down, and put it back in place. Okay, I need to show you the thing before I forget about it and y'all get stuck. Okay. We have four finished uh, edges. Okay, this is what we're probably gonna you're probably gonna run into and need help with. Okay, I'm gonna put these two pieces together. See, when you bring this up and you need to bring this up and push one down, it'll mess up one of those uh, edges. So what you're really gonna what you're gonna need to do is put an unfinished edge up there to replace one of them. So then, when you bring this up, replace a finished edge, then flip it over and put that other unfinished edge that you put up there before right there so the other edge right there was never messed up these weren't messed up and you got that piece that you need to put right there okay so keep doing that I'll show you another one see well this one has another unfinished one uh, oh yeah I'll flip that up take the place of that finished edge bring this up bring it down and we will then flip this blue this way okay now what color we're we using okay orange and green and orange okay so we're just gonna keep on edging up all the we're gonna keep pairing up all the edges until it's done so let me put this in fast mode 